Uh, greetings one and all. Welcome to the uh, Easy and Delicious Kitchen once again. Um, yeah, I'm just uh, cooking up some braised um, garlic chicken today. So I've already thrown in about 20 cloves of, cloves of garlic. Um, I didn't properly peel them, doesn't matter. And I've just been frying them for a few minutes, just in, um, in a fairly high temp, but I've now turned that temp down now. Bear with me today because I'm trying this brand new induction <laughs> heater because some of you may have seen that last video. I was very really, um, unhappy with the uh, electric system here. So I've just basically pulled it straight out of the box, sat it on top. So this is an absolutely new journey for me. I actually had to get a new um, wok as well because my old one didn't uh, work on it. So um, this is a specially made induction one. Big shout out to one of my subscribers for um, sourcing it for me for half price, Matty Boom Boom. Thanks mate, and thanks for dropping it off late last night too, Matt. Good on you. Alright, let's get on with the cook. So, um, like I say, I've had this garlic going. So now, I'm going to add some chicken thighs with the bone in that I've just lightly floured and um, seasoned with salt and pepper. So in they go. Just see how to go with this temp. I'm just turning it up a little bit. <laughs> like I say, you're, um, this is all new to me, this, this thing. Uh, <laughs> I'm happy to have you here with me to, um, to the experiment. Never used one before, so. So I'll just get these, um, I'm actually sort of trying to push the garlic a bit out of the heat now. Just while we brown this chicken up a bit. Sides like that. I've got one more bit. Perfect. Good on you, Matt. It's a good size. And we all love a half price bargain. <laughs> Alright. So I'll just brown these up for a bit and get back to you. Guys, uh, welcome back. Um, yeah, so what I've done now, I've got that chicken reasonably brown. I'm just going to back off the heat a bit. Look, this is a very, very, very simple, easy dish. So um, I wanted to especially do an easy dish today because I am testing out this new equipment. Um, in saying that, it's easy, but it's still delicious. And that's what this is all about. So I've just turned that down, this, the maximum on this is 2000, so I'm assuming 600 is pretty good for a simmer, but we'll see how we go. Now to the, I did, I think I said, I just drained the oil off that. So to that, this is, um, there's only three ingredients to add to the, the braised mixture. We've got a bit of soy sauce. There's not much, a couple of tablespoons. We've got some, um, Chinese cooking wine, about the same. Uh, and probably just a tad more chicken stock, so maybe, I don't know, about, about half a cup or so of that. And that is our braising sauce, and we're just going to simmer that away. Um, yeah, probably, I don't know, 20 minutes or so, but until the chicken looks pretty tender and the garlic's gone pretty soft. It already has gone pretty soft from the frying, but yeah. Now, because I don't know what I'm doing with this thing, I might just get the temp up until at least starts boiling and then turn it back down again. And I'll get back to you. Well, here I'm back about 10 seconds later. Man, this thing's turbocharged. I only put it to 1400 and it just basically started boiling straight away. So um, that's that's a good thing. No mucking around. So now, this is going to be a bit of a test for this thing to see if we can do a bit of a lower simmer. So I'll tr see what happens at 800. And that's still um, bubbling away there. Eh? 
Keep that down to 600. Not down to 400. From what I believe, the way these work is they actually just, they don't actually have an even temperature when you're simmering. They just sort of turn on and off, so anyway, that looks pretty good. That's on 400. Alrighty, so we'll leave that for about 20 minutes. I'll probably turn them once in about 10 minutes. And then, um, yeah, it should nearly be ready. Like I said, it doesn't get much easier than that, but I assure you, this is absolutely delicious. Alrighty, guys, I'll talk to you soon. Alrighty, guys, um, welcome back again. So I've just uh, served up a plate of this. It's been simmering away, like I said, for, you know, it might have been a little bit longer than 20 minutes, maybe 25 minutes. But yeah, just so that chicken looks nice and um, done. So I've served it up here with, um, yeah, obviously some rice. Uh, put plenty of that braising liquid over the top of it and I've just sprinkled some chives over it. So without further ado, I'm going to um, give it a taste. I'm, just before I taste it, I have to say I'm really, really happy with this uh, induction system. It was worth work the treat. So. Anyway, let's get on with the tasting. So, wow, that's tender as. So let's just have a look at that there. Chicken's cooked beautifully. Yeah, get some um, bit of garlic with it. Oh, the garlic's lovely and soft. Ooh, this bit of rice. And let's taste it. Yep, that is really, really good. I'm very, very familiar with this dish. I've made it you know, dozens of times in the past, and that turned out perfect. All right, guys, that's it for this week. Like I said, it's um, a very, very easy one this time, but man, give that a try. Sometimes the easy ones are the best. I, um, look, I am. Um, I want to thank everyone who's subscribed to the channel so far, I really appreciate it. So I'm up to, I think it was 33 or 34. So obviously, if you enjoy this, I'd love it if you could subscribe. Um, no worries if you don't want to, but um, it'd be awesome if you could. Alrighty guys, I'm going to finish this off. And I'll see you all next time.